from Minnesota's most watched station. This is WCCO 4 News, live at the Minnesota State Fair. Hi, I'm Annabelle. And I'm Ben. This is, the, this is your WCCO at the State Fair newscast. We begin today with a developing story from the Midway. Right now, State Fair office officials are on the lookout for a giant stuffed gorilla. We're told it's black and lime green and at least eight feet tall. It was last spotted near the Ferris wheel. Officials don't think it's, he's dangerous, but if you see him, call 911. Over near the pet center, fairgoers are reporting a strange howling sound. Officials were called in it to investigate. It turns out it was just the dogs at the pet center trying to keep up with all the people belting out ushers and samba hunt songs at the giant sing-along. That's a look at your state fair headline. Let's send it over to the sports. Hi, I'm Jonathan with a look at sports. A bit of controversy is brewing after a new grand champion was named in the state fair ring toss rodeo. A 10 year old girl from the Iron Range went five for five, beating our town Chris Saffer by one. WCCO's investigative team is on the story. It looks like the 10 year old was a ringer brought in from Iowa. We'll continue to follow the story, but right now let's get a look at the weather. Thank you. It's a hot one out there at the state, here at the state fair. Um, so hot, the ice cream cones are melting in less than two minutes. Snow cones are lasting only about three minutes. And a warning that brain freeze numbers have tripled this year as fairgoers are trying to keep cool. I'm Terry in the Weather Center. Back to you. What's your news for today? I'm Annabelle. I'm Jonathan. And I'm Ben. Thanks for watching WCCO 4, no 4 News at the This State has Fair. been a WCCO 4 News update from the Minnesota State Fair. Thanks for watching.